of ISOH Impact. Feeding has always been a part of our ministry. But what I like about Kids Against Hunger is that you have four to five meals, you have six meals in a bag, and they've got the vitamins. So when you're feeding somebody this packet of meal or family, they're sitting down and eating it and they're talking to you about it. have a far-reaching effect across the uh, oceans, I guess helping areas of the world that really are in crisis and really need our help. These people here today are all volunteers and some of them have donated money that's allowed for this pack and it's a very, very efficient way to actually make a difference in this world. Uh, I, can't, I can't stress that enough. This is uh, mostly international help, and I'm from uh, Sierra Leone, where this Ebola is uh, existing, and I'm thankful for these people trying to help uh, my own country, and uh, I'm grateful. There are people out there who really need help. There are people who are suffering, can't find food to eat. And when I was in Liberia doing the war, we didn't have food. We had to look for other things to eat. We're eating leaves and all kinds of things, so I'm sure this will be beneficial to people who are ready in need. to reduce the number of starving and malnourished children around the world. It empowers kids to make a difference in the world. It lets five-year-olds, 13-year-olds, 99-year-olds be a part of something where they're making a difference. It's hands-on, you're working on a line, you're building this food. Every six seconds, a child dies of starvation. And we have so many malnourished kids in America as well that are food insecure, that this would provide them with the nutrients that they need. because it helps kid, uh, people that are in Africa that have Ebola and that are quarantined in some villages so we can give them food so they can get better and get out of there quicker.